House of the Blue Sunbright is a quest in Dragon's Dogma 2 and is started after completing the side quest The Gift of Giving, done in the Vernworth slums and after you've completed a certain amount of main story missions as well. I'm not 100% sure but I think this one is possibly failable as well so make sure to follow along. So after you've done The Gift of Giving and a certain amount of main quests, the Townsend's Estates housemaid will reach out to the player when they pass by the common quarter and ask them to continue this conversation with her at her master's manor and this will trigger the start of the House of the Blue Sunbright quest. Head to the estate and then the player will meet Sebastian and you will learn that he needs his lookalike to take his place at the manor while he gets his sick mother her favourite flowers from Melv. I must confess I feared you would not, but I forget myself. I should like Thank you. It was in the slums that I witnessed you speaking with the girl. Would you be so kind as to bring her here? To find Sebastian's lookalike, you will have to head to the tent in front of the Gracious Hand Church and strike up a conversation with Daphne, who is the person you helped with the quest before. After convincing her to help Sebastian, head to Townsend Estate and introduce her to them. I was hoping you'd come by so I could thank you again. All right, I'll do it. was in the slums still looking well look young ma indeed i could be staring into a mirror diana will you dress her and instruct her in her role as you wish young master in the manor diana will dress yeah. daphne and help her fit into the role and then everyone will move to the dining room to prepare for sebastian's trip to melv next the arisen has to talk to daphne and diana and then give sebastian three medicines that can cure his debilitations of blight and sleep and also help prevent attacks from monsters but you're not given any information on what exactly items you should be giving them and so this is why this quest is failable but i will make sure you get all three of the correct things first head to the town sundry store and buy two of the items from here the detoxifying decoction and waking powder there's a ladder here might as well take a look while you're here The final ingredient is something that smells of cyclops and you can give them a misshapen cyclops eye dropped by one of the cyclopses. You will already fought some of them as part of the story at this point, but if you don't have one there is a cyclops not far from the town. Once collected, head back and drop off your ingredients, and then Sebastian will head for Melv, and you have to wait two in-game days and return to complete the quest and get your rewards. Guys, that is it, how to finish the quest of the House of the Blue Sunbright. Like and subscribe for more Dragon's Dogma 2 guides, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye. And monster repellents with me. What precisely would you suggest? My thanks. I'm certain these will come in useful. Now, I really must be going. Wish me luck. We must rest, though the sun is still up. Home at last. Welcome home, young master. Thank you, Diana. I am glad to be back. It was a hard journey. But I found what I sought, a blue sunbright, the sigil of our house. I only hope mother will be pleased. Oh, a blue sunbright. I thought they were make-believe. Oh, no. They're quite real. Rather rare, though, and particularly to Melv. I'm surprised you've heard of them, to be frank. Really? Well, there's a picture of one stuck to the inner cover of a book that was donated to the Gracious Hand. I asked Sir Kendrick about it. He told A picture, you said? I believe Miss Daphne is describing a book plate. The book in question will have been a donation from this very house. Indeed, the mistress has been very generous in her support of the gracious hand over the years. For true? Oh, I must tell her thank you. I think I could arrange that. I am certain my mistress would be delighted. Yes. Well, as for me... I'm just pleased to be home safe and sound. All this racket. 
What's going on? Good gracious, what is the meaning of this? Oh, you must be the lady who's been supporting the gracious hand. What precisely have you told this girl? Not a word, mistress. I swear. Good. As for you, girl, you need not thank me. Tis the privilege of to be sure to leave the house unseen. And fare you well, child. Know that where e'er life come, Diana, I would speak with you. What was that all about? Mother seemed awfully perturbed. I do wonder what that was all about. Though I'm not sure we ought to pry. Thank you.